digestion our teeth how are teeth useful to us teeth give proper shape to our face teeth help us to speak properly main function of teeth is to chew our food chewing breaks down the food into smaller pieces these can be swallowed and digested easily we have a pair of jaws in our mouth each jaw has a row of hard bone like teeth the upper jaw is fixed but the lower jaw can move together they form a complete set of teeth daddy my tooth fell out don't worry it will appear again is it true yes milk teeth fall out one by one and new ones grow in their place Now let's learn about sets of teeth. Human beings have two sets of teeth, temporary teeth and permanent teeth. Babies are born without any tooth. They get their first tooth between the age of 6 and 9 months. By the age of 2 and a half years, a baby has 20 teeth in the mouth. These teeth are called milk teeth or temporary teeth the milk teeth fall out one by one from 6 to 12 years of age and gradually new teeth grow in their place the set of new teeth that takes place of the milk teeth are bigger than the milk teeth this new set of teeth are called permanent teeth in adults there are 32 permanent teeth in total 16 in each jaw types of teeth teeth have different shapes and sizes on the basis of their functions These are of four types: incisors, canines, premolars, molars. Incisors: sharp, flat teeth in the front of each jaw are called incisors. The incisors are also known as cutting teeth and they are the sharpest teeth. they have sizzle like shape they are used to bite the food and shovel it inwards there are four incisors located at the front of each jaw so in total there are eight incisors canines or tearing teeth are sharp pointed teeth present one on both sides of the incisors these are used for tearing food there are four canines two in each jaw premolars flat and broad two teeth present on both sides next to the canines are called premolars or cracking teeth they are used to crush and chew the food there are eight premolars four in each jaw molars at the back of each jaw there are flat and broad teeth called molars or grinding teeth they help in chewing and grinding the food well molars are broader than premolars they have broad upper surfaces to grind the food there are 12 molars 6 in each jaw 3 on each side
inside parts of a tooth tooth has three main parts crown neck and root the crown is the part of a tooth that is visible to us on smiling or opening the mouth it remains above the gum line the part of a tooth below the gum line is called the root the root fixes the tooth in the jaw the part of the tooth in between the crown and root is called neck it is covered by the gum line the outer hard cover of a tooth is called enamel enamel is the hardest substance in our body it protects the tooth from wear and tear during chewing below the enamel lies the dentine This is yellow bone like layer that supports the enamel. The center of a tooth that lies inside the dentine is called the pulp. It is soft and has blood vessels and nerves. The nerves are connected to the gum through a hole in the root. These nerves help us feel a toothache taking care of our teeth teeth help us to cut tear and chew food during eating food particles get stuck in the gaps between our teeth if these food particles are not removed and teeth are not cleaned properly germs or bacteria can grow on them they form a yellow sticky layer called plaque the germs or bacteria change the sugar present in food particles into an acid this acid makes a hole in the enamel which is called cavity when the cavity reaches the pulp pain starts in the tooth this is called tooth decay tooth decay results in bad breath toothache indigestion bleeding gums as well as cavities so taking care of teeth saves them from decay we should eat foods that contain a lot of calcium and vitamin C these foods help make our teeth strong and prevent tooth decay foods like milk cheese and cottage cheese are rich sources of calcium while lemons oranges gooseberries etc are rich sources of vitamin C Now let's learn some tips for keeping teeth healthy and strong Brush your teeth twice a day once in the morning and once at night before sleeping Move your brush both upwards and downwards while brushing your teeth do not use pins or other pointed objects to clean in between the teeth a dental floss can be used for the same floss is a special kind of silk thread which is used to clean in between the teeth Rinse your mouth with clean water after every meal. Too much of sweets or aerated drinks causes tooth decay. We should avoid them. A regular visit to the dentist at least once in 6 months can help in maintaining healthy teeth. teeth and digestion 
the food that we eat after digestion provides energy to our body digestion is a process in which the food we eat is broken down into simple and soluble substances that are absorbed by the body let us know about what happens to the food in our body process of digestion digestion of food takes place in digestive system various organs play their role in it it can be understood easily in following steps mouth teeth chew and grind the food the food mixes with saliva in mouth saliva breaks the starch of food into simple sugars and also makes the food soft it can be easily swallowed now food pipe food now passes through the food pipe to reach the stomach once the food passes from the food pipe it enters the stomach and there it is churned and mixed with digestive juices and these digestive juices break down the food into simple and soluble form the liver produces bile it helps to digest fats in small intestine the pancreas also produces some juices These help to digest carbohydrates, fats and proteins in small intestine. Small intestine is a long coil tube that produces some digestive juices. The process of digestion complete here. Bile and pancreatic juices act here. from small intestine the food reaches large intestine it holds the undigested food absorbs water from it and forms semi solid waste called feces the semi solid waste that is feces is passed out of the body as stool through an opening called anus Now let's learn some healthy eating habits. Always wash your hands properly before and after meals. Always chew the food well before you swallow. Eat fruits and vegetables daily. Take a balanced diet to stay healthy. Drink plenty of water every day. Take your food at fixed times.